So you're telling me if there's four holes in Fruit Loops, the yes, four loops. The loops, if you will. And you said that all of them have been filled. Yes. Okay. But I'm trying to understand. There's, yeah. there's mouth, right. but, butthole. Yes. Now, it could be peanut or Vagoober. Right. If it is for Goober, you could get away because there's two holes down there. There's a secret spray foam one that they don't yeah, tell you about. Yeah, I don't think you're supposed to. No, you can't. Well, no, you shouldn't. Don't take and we're not it. entertaining it. So, <laughs> sorry, uh, but we if, if you're working with PP, uh-huh. you could sound. Well, yeah, you could sound. A so woman. that's the third hole. So what's the fourth hole? Like, what hole is being filled that I can't fill? You got you got more holes in your body, man. No, no, no. But like, what? You're just doing one nostril. You're just doing one ear. That doesn't make sense. That's asymmetrical. I never said anything about sounding. I'm aware. You haven't corrected me. You jumped there. Uh, you did not stop me. I can't. It's not my. I no, gotta. You, put, you you don't try. When the masks come down, I gotta put mine on first. You know what, Matanui? What about him? Masks. Sometimes the reference is just that I have a thought. <laughs> you know, you realize that I don't know what I'm doing. That's the fun part. Oh, I know. And when we start talking, I don't do the, I'm thinking in my head, then I have to think about how to word it. You get, mm-hmm. I, don't, I, don't, I don't do the processing now. Right. But unfortunately, that means that I, I too am trying to understand what I just said. But uh, Matanui uh, is part of Bionicle lore. Yeah. There's a lot of masks in there, and so yeah. when the mask comes down, right? There's, you know, what I needed? I needed to reference an event in Bionicle that would involve masks, and then that would have been a really good, like, deep cut on the Bionicle lore. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Good to know. I'm gonna go look up mm-hmm. things about Bionicle so that I can make this joke again. Would you like? Would you like to borrow? Some, yeah. Do you some mind? Books? Yeah. I, actually, yeah. Here, I'll flip through them while we're. Uh... <laughs> Oh, perfect. Here, here you go. Thank the, you. The purity of the original oh, text. Thank you. Well, like now I can I can do some research. Like you know, I, some I, market basket research. Did I have? De- you were like, that's a deep cut about the fucking Mario Kart circuit, and I'm like, well, I didn't make that. Well, now I have to. Well, I don't have to, but I thought it was fun. Yeah. Still not like in 150 CC though. Okay. Like it's it, the the jump between 100 and 150 is hard when you haven't played in a while and the reason you got back into it was to three-star all of the cups again. You know, though, if you start at 150, you don't then have to do the 50 and 100. If you get three-star and 150, it counts for 150 as well. So, like, you don't have to do these maps five times. I hate to be the one to tell you that. No, I know. I, I'm I'm sorry that you have to be the one to tell me that, but I've also played Mario Kart 8 on multiple profiles, and I've always done it 50cc first because, like, chronologically. Right. Like, no, it makes sense. Nothing ever told me if you do 150cc, it'll count the others. Like, how how would you know that? Well, I mean, like, if you play, like, Halo, if you beat it on Legendary, that counts as, like, Legendary, Heroic, Normal, and Easy, because you did the hardest version. Mm-hmm. So, like, from, like, an achievement perspective, you get all of the achievements. Ooh. That said... I know where I went wrong, but keep going. That said, though, an important distinction with Mario Kart is that if you do Mirror Mode... That does not get you mirror mode 150, 100, and 50. It's its own. It was considered like mm-hmm. its own thing. And now 200 is also its own thing. So like even if you were to, from the very like first time booting up the game, at least in the past, maybe it's different now, maybe there was an update, but at least in the past, even if you beat them all on 200cc, you would have only beaten them on 200cc. Yeah. But if you then do mirror, it's only mirror. But then if you do 150, it's 150, 150 all at once. Ah. I think uh, I'm really glad that you made you brought up like the halo and the achievement thing because I think mm-hmm. that's where I went wrong. The reason why I didn't translate that type of logic is because Nintendo doesn't really do achievements or trophies yeah. or anything, so I didn't yeah. even think about it like that. True. Like that's the fun part of Nintendo games. You pick it up and play. Listen, there's no master chief. Sega does what Nintendo don't. Mm-hmm. And you know what Nintendo won't is sue us. Hello. <laughs> Hello. Welcome to the Hell, Hell yeah, yeah podcast. podcast. Now available 
now. When you're here, you don't leave. And if you do, we know we can see the numbers. Those retention rates. I'm watching you. I'm watching you. Oh, I don't remember what the original bit that we were going on about was, but it doesn't really matter. It doesn't matter. It's about masks. When the mask comes down, I feel like I could read all of these books in a very short sitting. Yeah. Mood. And they're great. I mean, they're not. Some of them are good. A lot of them are just pretty, pretty basic and, you know, yeah. Mm -hmm. But some of them are great. R resisting the masculine urge to go, I could read them while we podcast. I could do both. Mm -hmm. Because it's like, Tea. I am man. You know, like I am the peer you roar. I, I am unstoppable. I could do any. Who says I can't do both at once? No one. Am I, who says I could do both at once efficiently? Also no one. No one. <laughs> Still no one. It, you, you can't, if you're only able to give 50% of your energy to, to two things, it's still taking all your energy. 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 Oh. So, it is Pokemon Go Community Day. No. no. Not Community Day. Pokemon Go Fest. Pokemon Go Fest. The second and final day of Pokemon Go Fest 2023. Oh. During which one can get Carbink. Deancey and uh, that other one. Uh, Mega Rayquaza. Big Snake. Rayquaza? Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Big Snake. The one and the same. Yes. And I have the Mega Candies to Mega him, but I have yet to Mega him because I'm like, it's not time yet. Mm. Oh, because oh, cause you won't be able, you need a lot of backstock, right? Otherwise, you have to do it like once a week until you can just do it free forever. Mm -hmm. I just haven't done it just because I'm like, Mega Rayquaza is not particularly super effective against himself uh i mean he's fine because because it's dragon dragon versus dragon but mm -hmm. you know it's it's also like i already have mega salamance running because he's been like been been being my boy oh it's because that's not on oh oh wait yes it is yeah i just why is that I, I unplugged it oh the light yeah oh okay I unplugged it for the charger, but then like, uh, like I, I like my like the the charger port on this phone, like it actually like I've gone and like got the the tools to like clean it out and stuff, mm -hmm. and I think that I I think I fucked it up at some point between either just trying to put the the the, the cables in just you know at night when you're tired and shit, mm -hmm. but like I think I I put a little bit too much pressure accidentally trying to get stuff out on the little like. Mm -hmm. The chip part you of it. Got one of the pins. Yeah, I got one of the pins. So now I gotta just like account for that all the time, which is difficult. Yeah. Yeah. Like, oh man, dude, having like putting the GPS on in my car, I gotta like have the phone at a weird angle, and I'm just like, what am I doing? Cool. What am I doing? What is ha Who are you? Who are you? Hall so far have you gotten anything interesting they increase the shiny rates i have gotten two shinies so far today i got a shiny poochie in there Ooh, that's um, a good one. Mm -hmm. it makes him a little golden boyo um i think it's a boyo it's a boyo that then you know turn, uh, evolve mm -hmm. into my diana um Ooh, that's a good one. Mm -hmm. as, as you don't nickname your shinies, that's right. I don't nickname anybody unless it really jumps out at me. I caught a very tiny Jigglypuff yesterday, mm -hmm. and I named it Lil Breath, because I figured, yeah. I don't think you'll want it, but you could have it yeah. if we ever needed like a, a dummy trade sort right. of thing. As like, I got, I'm going to give you a little breath. I have, I have a, f I have a... <laughs> I have I have a four star, I have a four star Wigglytuff and now I also have a four star Jigglypuff and I hold oh. them both dearly but they're horrible because it's still just Jigglybee. Mm -hmm. it's still just the Jigglypuff line but I love them mm -hmm. and then I also got Lupani oh word well Baniri but then I evolved mm -hmm. to make Lupani Lupani I'm curious I don't know what the I'm, I'm I guess I'm thinking of like well, I'm like well, I wonder what the Mega looks like I'm like probably just the same pink you could probably extrapolate yeah I think it just makes like the pinky like parts in her little like yoga track suit with the slitty slits in the pants. Mm -hmm. Ah, yeah. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. 
So why did they not make Primal Rayquaza? Do we think? Why did they make Primal Kyogre and Primal Groudon and then go mega for Rayquaza? Do you want an actual answer? Yeah, if you got so one. So you're, you're asking the question of my tattoo, actually. Oddly enough, she's she knows why. Okay. This is her story. Should I ask her? Yeah. You could ask her. Madam. Zidia. <laughs> Please explain. Mm-hmm. So I don't have it colored in yet, but like this is like her mega stone thing. Okay. So <clears throat> in Omega Ruby Alpha Sapphire, the reworked or uh, like the remakes of the original Gen 3 games. Yes. There's the like the gro- the, the, the in the lore, Groudon and Kyogre as they exist now, like I don't know if it's necessarily that it's never clear with legendary Pokemon if it's there's only actually one. Right. Or, or if like there's... Like there's just not a, a small lot of them. selection of them. It's like th- there's maybe a handful in the world, but in this area, it is like that Pokemon is known there as a legendary thing. Like, you know, like the Ente Ra- Ente Raikou and Suicune being the like legendary beasts. Yes. Um, ooh, delicious. Uh, kind of thing of like they're protectors and they help and do all that is kind of same concept of like I think it's just those three in particular, not necessarily that like those are the only ones to exist. That being said. Um, in the lore of the game, it's like there's like in the past there was like you know they actually the reason why they were so bad is they also in coincidentally basically had stones that would in what modern terms would be, uh, uh mega stones. Mm-hmm. Um, because even in the original game you had to get like the blue orb and the red orb mm-hmm. like the counter for the games to like deal with your thing to help them calm down. Yeah. But they the way that they kind of branched um it is very important that the generation uh like gen like the omega ruby alpha sapphire was the same generation that they introduced mega evolution Mm -hmm. so a little bit of like you know not canon so much but just like as a game um and so they gave a purpose to those orbs instead of just making them calm down it's like they're actually hidden mega stones so like finding out that like their primal versions like that's actually what they're doing so they kind of added some more depth and story Mm -hmm. That being said, that's why those are there. That's why they're established as primal. The reason why Rayquaza doesn't have this mega form is because, like, Rayquaza actually, there's like the Dragon's Ascent is its special move, Mm -hmm. is because in the game um, with Zinnia, Zinnia thinks that she's like part of her clan. She's the last of her clan who's like been waiting for the arrival of Rayquaza to help bring them like she has a very important role in bringing Rayquaza to mega Rayquaza to quell this ancient prophecy that's happening that the primals are back Mm -hmm. she has to come to the very harsh realization that her role is to help you Mm -hmm. do it but that like that does not diminish your role at all like I we you could not do it if it were not for her Mm -hmm. you know that little bit of just you know very fun little side story Mm -hmm. Uh, and I just needed a character here that was the only reason for that but works out well so in the game, you actually get a space suit and you actually go with Rayquaza and you fly to space. Mm. And you, uh, because you're fighting Deoxys, mm-hmm. actually, who sh- is like from space mm-hmm. and is like from the meteorites. And so, like, this other meteorite that you found, because Steven Stone in the games, who he uses, uh, his ace is Metagross. Mm-hmm. So, very cool character. I like him a lot. He was a champion. Never in a champion. He was never champion in any games I played because I only played Emerald. I want to play. I want to play Ruby. I want to play Sapphire. Actually, I'm gonna play that on stream. Fuck it. Um, well, I used to play it on stream. I'm younger now. I'm gonna. Yeah. Where is it? We got one. <laughs> that was nice. Mm-hmm. Um, so that's like the reason for it is like that whatever meteorite they originally found just so happened more or less to work with mega Rayquaza Mm -hmm. or to work with Rayquaza with the same type of mega energy to make it mega. And because it's speculation on my part, but because of the, it came from space, it's like it had a lot more mega energy. That wizard came from the moon. Mm Mm-hmm. You you recall? Yes. No, wait, wait, what was, what's the, what are you joking on the thing I said? Destiny. Destiny, gotcha. That wizard came from the moon. Oh, (laughs) that's right way way back yeah before i was taking king baby it was before your time mm-hmm. but i thought perhaps you would remember i i, I mean i've only it ever heard it in by. remembrance yes so it's tough like in i don't fairness remember. so did i because i yeah. didn't play the beta i remember that josh remember. did josh stand hey big ups for josh big ups for josh uh i have to say that legally 
but also he was there for the beta and that is pretty he big. was there for the beta that's cool yeah where was he for all of year one and year two of destiny 2 that's where, what i thought where has he been where has he been since the beta i still got it installed have i started this season no but i will it looks really good actually that i've not like, watched anything like, from it gonna be honest i've been pretty checked out of destiny for a while now i the the whisper the whisper is is Mm -hmm. back in my ear and it's going hey ooh, hey you like hive yeah you do like hive i do like hive plus they brought back crota's end yeah i saw that and i'm like i know people shit on it i don't care i liked it a lot i think it's one of those where i'm like why don't they just fucking like if you want to bring stuff back like just bring it back like there's no, like I'm not gonna argue. Like I'm not arguing about more content. And I like, know. Well, like people love to be like, it's not even a real raid. It's tiny. I'm like, I don't care. Listen, sometimes it is a raid. I'm the kind of person classified as raid. That part you understand. Are I, you Bungie? No. I just I'm like it's a raid, and also maybe not everything has to be fucking last wish. Okay. Right. Maybe I don't want to sit here for fucking three hours getting the damn thing done. Sometimes a story can be short and good. And I think that uh, Crota's end is short and good. I, I, I personally, I agree with you. I think that um, we do, like, raids do not have to be a fucking, like, gauntlet. I think that it is fucking awesome that they can be. I think it's great to have them, to have yeah. those. But at the same time, like, exactly kind of the same, like, exactly the point you were making. I'm trying to. <laughs> just stay the cord's not long enough to be at the table and I'm like it's fine it's not that big of a deal but it is just like I'm like okay then okay then give me the give I'm me like close co- I'm like, give oh. me the ch- I was like I'll go ahead and just close Pokemon give me, Go because give me it's the staying boy. open so it can't charge because it's trying to stay open as a silly bagoose <gasps> Oh, really? A bagoose? <laughs> That's one of them new ones. Ooh. Oh, no. What did, wait, wait, wait. What did I do? Did you just knock the HDMI? I think you did. I mean, it's still filming. Okay. Yes, I just pulled the HDMI case. It's just a, it's just a silly little thing. I just mm-hmm. A little... The doo-doo, doo-doo. Hey, we're still recording. Doo-doop. Doo-doop. Oh, I've been invited to a raid. Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god. For a Goomy? Are you fucking kidding me? Goddamn Goomy. I mean, I'll I'll do it, because like, if I could get a shiny Goomy, that'd be pretty cool. Ooh, it's like all yellow and shit? Yeah, it looks like snot. Mm. And that's pretty cool. I got a shiny uh, Wurmple, made lovable, I told you earlier, but because mm-hmm. you know, I'd still love them if they were a worm. But... I really do. I, I got my shiny. Um, what was it? I got it not too long ago. Nothing is happening. It just stayed charging. Thank you. I also have like a QR pad. Yeah. Yeah. Okay, that might be easier. I, like I like I just like I'm like I'm almost good of like I'll just leave it alone so it gets to like twenty five percent. That's all I need. Let me know? finish the Goomy raid and then I, yeah, I'll, no I'll I'll grab no a, I'll grab a charge. We're having fun. Hey, we're just we're just chit chatting. We're just chit chatting. We're just doing bits. It's the Go Fest episode. What did you expect? I I told you guys last week this is a Pokemon Go podcast. I I don't know why you're shocked. <laughs> You, who would just go on the internet and tell lies? I told. Uh, listen, I've been telling them. I stay telling them. As you should. So you got a shiny Wampel. I got a shiny Wampel. I got. I think I told you a while back. I got a a, a shiny uh, Slurpuff. Oh okay. It looks like cookie dough. Yeah. Which is real. Which is what I needed. It was very apt. 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 Ipt. Mm-hmm. Jennifer Lopez. I, oh, crikey. <laughs> <laughs> that was good. <laughs> oh, man. Oh, jeez. Ooh. Uh, I'm trying to think uh, of something to say. If I had a dollar. Right. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> you want to grab a pad? The cu- I am leaking. Yeah. The, 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 the whatever... <laughs> Wait, you're leaking. 
I've heard that's a, like that's apparently a good thing. That depends entirely on what you're leaking. Uh huh. For men, sorry for for PP. Right. Mm-hmm. Well, it still depends on what you're leaking. Oh, like, I like guess if you could leak this, like if you're yeah. leaking pee, that's not great. You no, might that's frustrating. You want to get that checked out. And if you're leaking like blood, blood that's bad, or like that like green goo that gonorrhea does, also not great. Okay. What if you're leaking something you shouldn't be leaking? I'm pr- I, I'm gonna go out on a limb and say for the most part, it's probably only good if you're leaking pre cum, pre seminal fluid. What if, what if it was Laffy Taffy? That'd be very thick. Can you call that's that leaking? That's well, very I don't thick. know. But what if it happened? What like, if I'm, what if I'm squeezing out toothpaste? Yeah. I just want someone to just grab my dick and ring it, teeth. ring it out like a, like a tube of toothpaste, trying to get that last oh, little bit out. I just, dude, it's been so hard to get hard anymore. That just <laughs> fucking just, just mash it or something. Just roll it you like a piece of putty. I've lost all feeling. I just got silly putty down there. It bounces when it hits the ground. <laughs> I'm a little, I like to take a more creative twist. I call I call it I call it a, 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 a modeling clay. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Except it has no form. I stick Don't my put it in a, I stick, I'm trying to put it in the kiln. I stick my dick into one of those like play doh molds, and then it comes out like hair out of like the little top. Oh, like. absolutely. <laughs> I actually, well, I at least I kind of like. Do you think you could like fashion one? fashion one do some home diy right and 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 make it so that like you make it like a cum spray okay you know you get what i'm saying yeah. like you kind of make a device where like to, to 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 like uh like obviously if you if you pinch the head and w- right before you're about to splurt uh you know you can like kind of like get some more pressure behind it and like have a more like accurate precise shot right but sometimes like what if your goal is to make a mess well, I just put my thumb on the end, like when you have a garden hose, oh, and yeah. I just sort of, like, just oh, oh, you get a nice fan wide spray. spray. Yeah, mm-hmm. I mean, it still is like burst mode, like, eh, 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 but it's uh-huh. good. It's good. Oh, it's good. <laughs> they like that. Oh, oh, you got feet. Oh, interesting. Uh, I well, you know, I, when we're done, research is important. When we're done, I carry their limp body over to you know, like, like at the airport the when mantle. they had a little like, was it good? Was it bad? Green button, red button. Oh. <laughs> I thought you were going to say, you know, the little big scale that they have the luggage. <laughs> well, I picked them up with the hook to well, see how much. Well, because you, you put them on there first and you're right. to know how much you're come weighed. Exactly. You got to tear it. Yeah. They don't know. People don't know about the tear. They don't know about People that. think when I'm saying tear it up, they think I'm saying T-E-A-R. But I'm saying T-A-R-E, which is recognize, like, you can't, you got to acknowledge what you got before you make changes. You understand. I understand. It's free. Well, now I can't go get the pad yet yeah. because now I'm in the Mega Ray Plaza fight. But I understand. Would you like me to fight or do you dodge? Uh, I sometimes dodge. Depends on you, how I'm You feeling. do your fight. I, I understand that the problem is more so you don't want me touching your phone with my hands. Right. As opposed to like helping you. Like with it, your rubber fingers. You don't. No one understands. I like, it could be grease on my finger. I don't know. And you don't want to have to deal with it because then you'll go, fucking God damn it. Why did he touch the phone? It's yeah. like, it's like. You ever notice how, like, your mess is okay? What's my mess? Just in general. Like, if you do something and it's gross or whatever, like, it's fine because it's all you and contained. But if someone does, like, does the same thing to your own thing, it's like, like, if I leave fingerprints on my phone, I'm just like, well, shit, I'll just, like, wipe them off real quick. Yeah. Someone else does. There's that moment of, like, fucking fingerprints. What was on your finger? Yeah, like, what, what was on your finger? Why, why are you leaving so much on there? I know what I'm leaving. Why, it's just... Why are you rubbing your, your nasty wet Cheeto hands on my thing? Why you produce so much oil? Yeah. Greasy. God, do, do, you, do you even have any wood or food? That's like when we were playing... Um, or villagers? What was that game we were playing? Scythe. Baldur's Gate 3. Baldur's Gate 3. <laughs> I've, been, I've been liking it. I, I enjoyed the one time we played it. Oh, you haven't played on your own at all? No. Mm. I thought about it and then I was like... I didn't have time. Um, I did so that I don't have to worry about keeping up with the story, yeah. which is not a bad thing. It's like, no, I'm going to go and tr- then I can just be like, we're just fucking around. Now yeah. we're just having fun. Um, I don't remember what the spell is, okay. but it makes, oh, it's called, it's grease or whatever. Yeah, grease. It, where it, like, grease make, it makes nasty grease. And the symbol, the, the symbol for the spell is a pig. And I'm oh, like, they're funny. not wrong. Yeah. But I'm like, damn. That was a choice. 
So it's like a yeah. little you know, like magical outline of a pig. <laughs> well, like that's all. Yeah, for for Greece, because yeah. how else would you make? I guess that's really clever. It's smart because, like you know, especially like you know, in the the oldie timeies, that's like you it know, is very uh, ridiculous. Alleged so. to be that's you know where that sort of thing would have come from. Come, come, mm-hmm. come, Greece, but the bottom. The bottom. But <laughs> but you know, it's I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. It is no, no. Know. So like, I'm I'm I'm. Uh, to be clear, that wasn't my final judgment. To but be rather, clear. like, I would like to acknowledge that, like, I do think it's very clever because I can't think of another way. To be honest, to like exemplify, to symbolize Greece. Well, what's odd to me is that most of them are like symbols that are a little less. Uh, like it's like a blowing wind symbol. Right. Which they're would a little less sense. defined. Like if there's like a symbol for like entanglement, it's just sort of like some squiggly lines. You just sort mm-hmm. of like get the vibe of it's like, oh, OK. Like, yeah. Like you, you're not so sure. You shouldn't just click on it. Like you should probably hover over it. Right. Like, it's just sense. very like direct that it's like, you want to make grease? Mm-hmm. Here's pig. Pig spell. Pig spell. And you're like, oh, does it turn him into a pig? Nope. No. Well, it does for a second, but you don't get to see it when they roll around. It. And I got to take, what I got to, I got to take, I got to, I got to, I got to extract that and then ring it out. That little video clip from the end of Wiener Weekend that I made what? where oh. it's like the, mm-hmm. the little like AI robot voice being like, Tell the, tell three friends about the podcast. You like filthy, disgusting hog rolling oh, yeah, yeah. around in slop, clamoring for more. Mm-hmm. A need, good, a good one. I need to take that and then like make that like a a, a a stream decky button, so that way like at the end of the thing we can just be like click and then like it does that. Oh, that's and so that's fun. like our outro. You know, so, like we, we still do. do our ridiculous like you know. Yeah. We say something disgusting, cut off, and then it's like. You fucking hog. You know what would be good? It's like, so uh, what we do is uh, we could multi-action it, actually. Okay. So we can make one of the buttons be end. Yes. And so we just have an end card Mm -hmm. that, you know, we only got to do it once or whatever, you know, themed ones, whatever. And then the multi-action will go switch to the scene with the end card or make that, like, thing visible. Mm -hmm. And then I think just making a new scene would be the easiest because then we don't have audio on the other scene. It's just... The only audio is that clip. The clip. And then you wouldn't have to go and strip the audio from that clip. Mm-hmm. You could just... I'd just take the clip. You could just take the clip and yeah. then you just put it under the thing. Or fuck it, you could actually just show the clip. Yeah, I think just show the clip. Yeah. As like a little like small aside. Mm-hmm. It'd be very fun. Yeah. I think that'd be very uh, clever, actually. I'm tired. Of Pikachu. Of Pokemon Go trying to shove Pikachu down my unwilling throat. I've had enough. I don't want to get a Pikachu. I had enough seven um, years ago. I've had enough. And I don't care that you put a cute little tiara on Pikachu. That's great, sweaty. Love that for him. Love that for he, they, she. I didn't ask for you to put that on, on Pikachu. And I don't want it. And I don't want Pikachu. Yeah. And that's that. <laughs> I, I stand with you. <laughs> Brothers in arms. Brothers in arms. I... <laughs> The amount of times, like, me, the bitch, who just, like, I, fo- I I will follow the instructions to the end of the earth because the instructions did not say to stop, you know? Like, I, don't know, I'm just, I didn't know when, so I figured, they're like, you'll know when to stop. And I'm like, I felt like I should have stopped a long time ago. But nobody said nothing. But nobody said nothing, so I guess I'll just keep going. And with Pikachu, that's what I feel like. It's, there's, why is there a billion cap Pikachus? Because even with all these tiaras, I like I'm thinking like anytime there's those special events, I'm like, I get one or two, but I'm tired of it always being Pikachu. Like I just I just have to ask. And like when when anyone like says anything about like Pokemon and Pikachu and stuff, they're like, Pikachu is the most popular Pokemon. I'm like, because they made it that way. Is he? Like, and maybe I'm just asking the wrong people because I'm asking people who actually like at least have anything more than a cursory interest in Pokemon. Yeah. Cause like to be blunt, I feel like most people were like Pikachu is their favorite Pokemon. Annie is my stepmom. Yeah. If Pikachu is their favorite, Pikachu is my favorite Pokemon. Pikachu is their favorite Pokemon. It's cause like they don't know any other Pokemon. I'm going to go get it now. Oh no. I was looking for a pet. Pikachu is my favorite Pokemon. Yes. That's like, I think that's a good, it's a good, it's a good, um, do you want me to pause or do you want to van? I can van. Yeah. Okay. You can do whatever you want, Cam. I've been invited to another raid. Oh, yeah. here you go. 
You okay. can do it if you'd like. Cause this, oh, this. Do you want that? Yeah, it's, sure. It's the uh, good, uh, to get a shiny with a hat. That'd be lovely. Okay. I'm going to use all of your items. I have so many. Please mm -hmm. get rid of them. Absolutely. Oh, you have Terrakion. Oh, you have Reshiram. Dude, he's got so much nice shit. Oh, hello. I guess this is a good time to let you know. Hi. Uh, it is the 27th, I think. Yeah, it's a Sunday. You guys will see this in a bit later today. Um, but uh, hello. Good to see you. I'm vamping. Uh, oh, hello. It's a good time. I didn't even get to. I got to. I got to introduce myself. Well, you, then, you can keep doing it. Mm -hmm. Okay. See if this. I don't know if this will work off of the power that's from the laptop, but we're gonna see. Nope, doesn't get enough power. God damn it. Well, like, so if you have the other thing, I could just plug it in over here and like the yes. music, cause like, it's str it's on the Strumbugle bus. Oh yeah, I haven't been helping, but also I don't think I need to in this case. There you go. If they can't take out a Snorlax without me, they don't need you. Oh, I was like, plug it in right here. I, that, that was my exact thought. It was like, oh, how far? And that's the other thing is that everything is, is set everything's up. Everything's off of the one behind me, so we can't do that one Part of me is almost like, should we have had? Like, I guess we've never really, like, I need we, a, might need to, we might need to do a little remodeling. We need an extension cord is what we need. Yeah. Like, like a power strip, maybe? Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. We should uh, mm -hmm. we should plan doing that sometime, like I maybe could... this week or something. Like, I'll just come over and like, let's kind of like put stuff. I don't know, do something with the room. Yeah, because you guys don't realize it. It's just the wall. You don't know. Y'all don't know. You've never and the known. Chair. And they don't need to know. They should know. And they're not gonna know. And you know what? That's what they need to know. They don't. Know. All right, we're no longer on air. It's none of their business. I've been tired. Of telling them what their business should and should not be. You understand. I never stopped understanding. Does this problem hurt? Oh, very precariously. Okay. 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 Well, I don't know. What okay. to well, do about so what? all of the time that we've been talking. Mm -hmm. I got a fat 4% because most of the time it was charging, Pokemon Go was still open. So it just was in that, like, lock. But it's still on. And I'm like, D just stop both of those things. Yeah. Like, I'd rather, you, I'd rather you just take time to recharge and rest. Yeah. Than, uh, hurt me. Because you're eating into my time, Pokemon Go. And it's my own fault. But. It's not shiny. <sighs> I hate it. I hate it. I just want to die. I want him, but I don't like him. Nice, excellent throw, Thank though. You. That was good. I'm very happy with that. I didn't think you were gonna get that. I'm, I'm, I, I like, I love those I. ones. <laughs> you know what I had on my walk this morning? Tell me. Two excellent throws in a row. We love that. Yeah, and not even like missed throws. And I was trying. It was just one of those where I'm like, okay. Yeah. Like I anticipated it closing or whatever, and it's, you know, sometimes the Pokemon you don't realize how far away they are, even though they look big. I need to stop doing these because I don't need any more. Oh, it's already expired. Good. Okay. Yeah. You can just keep going forever. Well, I'm like, I don't need more mega energy. Well, how, I mean, you should. Well, because if you want to, like, increase the mega level, you, they, like, cost a lot every time. Yeah. So, you know. Or I have a thousand. Yeah, you're good. I yeah. Think. Yeah, yeah. Sometimes yeah. we got to know when to fold them. When to hold I know them. when to hold them. Mm -hmm. but unless you're hunting for shiny Rayquazas, the four star. Yeah. Which I have not gotten, but my two shinies are three star. That's You're welcome to have one of them if you would like. Thank you. I got a little breath. I'm gonna turn you. this over because I don't. I don't like that. I don't like looking at that gentleman. <laughs> the little fucking lemon pompadour. Yeah. We'll have to try one of these soon because they're apparently super sour. I've encountered a problem in my life that is a result of my wisdom teeth removal. Oh. That yeah. I'm hoping is temporary. Um, where I am, what, no, I'm good. I am over salivating all the time mm. and it's infuriating. Oh yeah. Like you just are drooling. Yeah. Well, it doesn't like get out, but it feels like I'm about to puke all the time. Not because I feel like I'm going to puke, but because like, you know, when you're about to puke and like, 
Mm-hmm. Turn into burn and you start salivating too much. You start tasting your mouth, uh-huh. which is, I hate when that happens. It's just like, it's Spit Town USA behind these lovely lips. And uh, yeah, I'd like to move out. It makes you like, it's like, what? Do I need to, <laughs> I need to move out? I need to move away. Like, you can't, what, you get a spittoon? Right, because that's fucking disgusting. So I just keep swallowing. I'm swallowing spit all day long, and I don't care for that. Mm-mm. So if, like, my body could, like, get over that, that'd be sickening. Hmm. Is it directly because of that? I don't know. I'm hoping it's because of that, because that would mean it's temporary and will go away. Mm-hmm. Did I, you do any research into this at all? Only very briefly. You Googled it and saw one thing and went, I'll look at it later? Well, Cause I do that the Google search was like, uh, yeah, it could be that, or it could be an allergic reaction, which it's not because it's been ongoing no matter what I'm eating. Uh, or it could be, you know, you have like a degenerative nerve disease. So I'm going with wisdom teeth mm-hmm. for my peace of mind. Because it it didn't happen until after the wisdom teeth. Yeah. It's directly correlated to the wisdom teeth. And he also literally was like, yeah, your nerve was like fully wrapped around the tooth. He's like, so you're probably going to have like some nerve weirdness for a while, which it did. It felt like my teeth were all being like shoved completely forward. They weren't. They Uh weren't moving at all. It was just because my nerve was weird. My teeth felt completely loose. Like every time I was chewing, it felt like my teeth were coming out of the sockets. They weren't moving. It was just my nerve being stupid. So I'm choosing to believe that this is just the newest iteration of that. Interesting. A new evolution. If you will. Oh, yeah, I will. I'll take it. It's free. If you're not taking it, you're leaving it. I think it's so interesting that Pokemon as a franchise, mm-hmm. so long ago, so many, many moons ago, gave up on Mega Evolutions because they're like, we need a new gimmick. Yeah. All the time. Uh-huh. They're like, we've had it. I got I to gotta calm myself down. <laughs> it's like you're bringing up, like, like I feel like a veteran from a war-torn country, right. and I'm just like, you don't bring it up, man. Yeah. Don't talk about how we got rid of Megas. I'm here. They got rid of Megas. They were like, stop asking about it. Don't you like Z-moves? Sit down. My favorite Z-move is, like, Ultra Necrozma uh-huh. is, v, like, Z-move, because if you do it, it takes, like, 45 seconds. <laughs> like, you just sit there while it's doing the whole animation, <laughs> and then you obliterate the fucking Pidgey or whatever you're fighting. Like, yeah. it's just... Yeah, but Pokemon was like... Mega Evolution hurts them, though. They were like, we don't do Megas anymore. Mm-hmm. And then, somehow, years later, Pokemon Go went... But maybe we do Megas now. And now Pokemon Go, like, they're keeping Megas alive. Absolutely. And they're not even like, here's some Megas, and then we're going to, like, quit it out. No, no, no. They keep, like, spoon-feeding us, like, a little extra Mega every season. They're like, now you may have Mega Tyranitar. We're going to turn the entire year, like, build-up is for Mega Rayquaza. Like, they're just, like... They're, they're drip feeding them. They're like, we're going to get you on that mega game till the end of time. Absolutely. And it's so interesting to me. I think it's like, a great advancement for Pokemon Go. I love it. I, no complaints in terms of like, I think megas are cool. Well, I but do you're think saying it was as a, a, someone who likes the Pokemon franchise a bit too, it's like super interesting that they... It's interesting that... that, that Neantic, they found a way to monetize I guess because they yes, can monetize Yes, that it. like Pokemon as like a corporation was like, yeah, you can add mega. You can add... Because like by the time megas showed up, Mm-hmm. In Pokemon Go, they were long gone from the games. Yeah. Well, so... I Pokemon guess... Go didn't even come out. I mean, I could be wrong about this. But if I'm remembering correctly, timing-wise, Pokemon Go didn't even come out until after the generation when, like, mm-hmm. the last Mega generation, right? Because yeah. yeah. Alola was the first one without them. Because there were two gens of Megas, weren't yeah. there? Well, no, no. So it was... Um, or was it the... It was like X a and Y, gen Omega... And uh, those came out in the same gen. Got it. There was the main line, and then there's like, the remake the or remake. whatever. Got it. Um, for better example, we have, um, like, uh, Scarlet Violet Arceus. Right. So, okay. um, uh, Sword and Shield, Snap 2. Oshkosh. Osh- Big Green Bay. Appleton. Although, I know, from what I recall reading, it's not so much that they, like, dropped it, like, they didn't like it or anything, but mm-hmm. rather... Um, the way that they describe it, like the, their philosophy at Game Freak is really interesting or at the Pokemon company, whatever uh, at Game Freak, because they make the games is like, you know, like it, it's not so much that they didn't think it was a good idea that they should bring. Like it's that they, they didn't want to bring it forward. It's just that like they like to try new things. Yeah, which like, makes sense. Yeah, which I like personally, it makes a fondness for the individual games in each generation, mm-hmm. because like if I want Megas, like 
Like, you know, I got my shiny Mudkip in my Alpha Sapphire. Mm-hmm. I got, I think I've gotten two badges. And I just never let myself have time to fucking play it. Yeah. Because I'm like, I spent so many hours soft resetting, like days, over months, over years. Yeah. That I finally got there. And now what? You play, I can, now I can play the game. Yeah. I don't want to. Yeah. I'm like, I will eventually, but. That was, it's so like in OSRS, old school RuneScape for those uninformed. Mm-hmm. For years, dangerous conversation topic right now. Recipe for disaster <laughs> sat like an albatross in my brain, Mm-mm-mm-mm. going, "You're never gonna get it. You've never had it. This will take so long, and you had to. You don't have the patience. You don't have the skills. You should just give up. You don't have the effort. Don't even give up. Don't you even don't even start. have mom's wacky numbers. Exactly. It's not even a question to give up. Don't even start." <laughs> don't, don't even, even start. fucking start sit just down just chill bro and so then i had a day where i was like no i'm not gonna stand for that i'm gonna finish recipe for disaster and i finished the whole thing in about three hours and then i went now what i'm like oh i can get the granite gloves okay mm. now what why'd you do the quest in the first place just because because i hadn't done it yeah. And because it had haunted me, mm-hmm. it whispered in my nightmares. As it should. Yeah. And it said, you're never going to be nothing. And I said, I'm going to try to be something. Yeah. That's fascinating. Like, I, I don't know. I, I guess it's so interesting how, uh, like, to hear how other people play games. Like, mm-hmm. what goals other people's ha- like, people have. Because, like, I remember when you guys finally got me into old school RuneScape. For a while, my goal was just like, well, like, like RuneScape was cracked for me because I'm like, the int- it is a MMO. Oh, yeah. Where you only care about yourself. Mm-hmm. It's everything you want. You want. Mm-hmm. It's like, I wish I could just do something and like level up skills. Yeah. You can't. Get in there. How, how did you waste so much time in RuneScape? Nobody knows. No one fucking knows. Because it's like, you just weren't, like, you were clicking on things, but you were like, I'm going to get flat. I was trying to make money. Which was your first problem. Well, exa- well, I was trying to make money in the wrong way. There are ways to make money that like also will bolster your skills or complete quests. I did none of those things. Sometimes to make the good money, you need to go do the quests. Yeah. Like I think for the longest time, I was like, well, I want like an Abbey whip and shit. Mm. Oh, yeah. I want all that stuff, but you need skill minimums. And then mm. I think like once I had gotten my quest cape, which I can't put on anymore, they've added more quests, but I got to go do those. Oh, I'm going quests. Um, I should try to I should try to get winter tote. Cause like Josh wants to do this like Iron Man thing, which like I'm. I just want to f- work on my character though. Like I don't want to start fresh. Do you, could we just start a clan? I've invested so much time into the one that I've got, and he's great. Mm-hmm. I mean, honestly, yeah, same. Like I've spent a lot of money on my account. Like, yeah. I'm like, why would I give that up? I don't know. I, I could tell. Like I'm not gonna lie. Well, I guess Josh would probably hear this too. But well, I also like what. In fairness to the conversation and me, like, not answering, me and Brandon were camping. Yeah, no, I, I, I realized that <laughs> after the fact, like, because I was talking to Ty, I was like, because uh-huh. I was like, as much as I love her, I'm like, I'm not, next time I'm going to, like, be more forceful with her because I want to give, I'm like, I don't want her to forget. I'm like, she's going to forget. It and have I fully forgot. And you had mentioned it to me. I fully forgot. I and then the day that she texted me, I was like, I'm not going to be home. <laughs> yeah, I can't. I'm not going because I can't. Yeah. And so, but she was actually, you know what? She was having a wonderful time at her party yesterday. I'm glad. She was great. She her hair and makeup looked so fucking great. I love she that. had a wonderful time. That's and good. it sounded like uh yeah. And you know, other shit happened apparently, which is also fun. I got to do something at this party that I love doing. One of my favorite activities. I got to uh be shown the gun collection. Oh. Mm-hmm. I got to learn a lot of things. Mm-hmm. Like about the AR fifteen. Mm-hmm. stuff and I'm like I'm just sitting there going mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. I'm thinking about how how many times I've had this exact same conversation with other yeah. like I'm just like okay but it was one of those where um you ever like you ever just you ever walk into a burning building metaphorically speaking like everyone's like Gosh, not metaphorically but literally, literally yes. yeah uh I guess like I have a grandpa Frank pause like, or side tangent to explain this. I have a grandpa Frank where if you start talking to him, isn't he the one that needed the big catheter and wanted everybody to know? Yeah. 
Yeah, that's Grandpa Frank. That's right. Yeah. Uh, you know, he's a he's a charmer, talker, very outdated mm-hmm. <laughs> um, at this point. But, you know, like you can get that energy. You can see that. And he's someone who will fucking just talk to you. And you're like, everyone's like, you got to pull away from him. You got to like, you got to save everybody. You know, everyone's got to save each other from him. You don't want to get trapped. But someone's got to talk to Grandpa Frank, you know. And I'm like that's really weird that you all kind of consider that. I'm like, it's interesting. And like, no, I don't want to talk, but I don't want to be rude. He's still talking. Mm-hmm. Like, I don't know. honestly, if I sit and talk to Frank, I don't have to go talk to my mom. So this is there you go. like, I'm already on the up and up. There I didn't want to be here. I don't like Thanksgiving. I love Thanksgiving. I'm taking welcomes because I'm tired of giving thanks. There you go. Like, I, I don't need it. Yeah. Like, I... I'm sorry. I love my Aunt Jane. I love her. Mm -hmm. I am tired of eating dry ass turkey. And like, it's Thanksgiving is only good if there's good food because Thanksgiving is the food is the food. And so like, I have been like lucky enough that for most of my life, if my family was hosting Thanksgiving, it was good food. If extended family was hosting, it was boo nasty trash. But because it was always boot nasty trash in those scenarios, my parents would then like we would have theirs and then we would go home and make our own and it would always be good. That's right. So every year I got a good Thanksgiving. Sometimes I get a good one and a bad one. Oh, I always got a good one. Got a good one. That's smart. And so like because of that, I love Thanksgiving. But bad Thanksgiving is bad. It's bad. It's it just it's a long day. It, it changed a lot once it was like. I'm driving and meeting up with them. Uh-huh. Like I, I'm driving my own car to my aunt's house, not mm-hmm. driving to my parents' house and then carpooling over the two c- couple of streets because they went a couple blocks over and I don't know where I'm at because I didn't grow up there. So like, right. you know, my siblings are like, yeah, like, you know, we go to Jen's house all the time. I'm like, I don't. I go for holidays. Um, that's so funny. Like, I think the best, one of the best Thanksgiving dinners I had one year was, uh, it may have actually been, I think, one of our friends' givings, but we had like yeah. we we got like I think we we must have we had so much like Stover's mac and cheese like we got like oh, two yeah. family size things because oh, yeah. like everybody wants it. Mm-hmm. And guess what? I got to eat almost into like almost every like almost the entirety of what I ate. I ate mashed potatoes and gravy because it fucked a couple yep. of rolls. Mm-hmm. I had uh, a little bit of turkey because I don't I don't care so much about the turkey and it's like mm-hmm. you know no one cares if you have one of everything. You just make your own plate. You yeah. do whatever you want. You know what I've started to learn? People can say whatever they want. Mm-hmm. I'm going to eat whatever I want. There you go. If I want, you know what? I'm sleepy. I'm Look, I'm passing out at 730. I'm waking up at 1130 to boot and rally. <laughs> Is it to boot and rally home like you it's, called that's me That's what earlier? I'm saying. It's 11, we wake yeah. up at 1130 and you boot right into that car and God, you rally on home. <laughs> God damn right, man. You kidding me? I got to go see a bunch of people, have a good time and take a nap. I couldn't ask for anything more. Yeah. Everyone else is like, well, Steve, it's your birthday party, man. Come on. Like, what are you doing? I'm like, y'all know I'm sleepy. Eepy Steve. That's right. <laughs> it's sleepy Steve. <laughs> <laughs> Portable bed. It took me a long time to realize that, like, when the internet says eepy, they now mean sleepy. Oh, what did I you think know. it was? I didn't know. I didn't listen. Oh, it took me a while to, like, to pick up on that. But I think, I, 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 yeah, that's interesting. My brain's like, well, why, why, why do they use EP? Because it's cuter. Because we get to drop the the beginning, and it's just an EP. Yeah, well, because if you think about when you are really tired, hunk you, hunk you, hunk I'm you. so tired that like it takes me a minute to say the word. Like I started saying the EP. word, but the voice took a second. Like I'm EP. Hunk you, hunk you, hunk you. Me, 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 me. You understand? I. Meow. I understand. You understand. We don't have a good one for you understand. We don't. Actually, that would be... We should be making our own sounds. We should just change all of the sounds to just be our own voices. So then we're just literally like, you understand. You understand. Just yeah, no, we really... like That's a, like genuinely, that's a really good idea. Yeah. I've been thinking about that. A uh, friend uh, of the channel, Marky Moo, once did oh. a similar situation when he was playing Monopoly with, with, his, with his two friends. And so he kept like recording thing mm-hmm. and then just like playing it again and they were like, like are you saying that or are you just playing it and he was just like like that doesn't matter gas didn't matter he was Absolutely. doing both constantly 
you know, I, I don't know how to make the sound, but it's that little like the little wobble sound in the Discord soundboard that Josh had. <laughs> I favorited that, and I will just be in VCs, and I'll just like it's quiet. Oh. I'll just, <laughs> people, like, what makes me laugh though is that like a lot of times like nobody says anything, and I'm just like, this is funny. <laughs> this is funny to me. Where are you all at? That when I do funny. it, Josh starts laughing immediately. Right. It's Josh's sound. Yeah. Like, of course, I, I, as, as it should, full credit to Josh. I, I love it. I, I don't know. I, I just, I, I can't wish you would play it. it and then no one says anything and you just go, why is no one laughing? I have. <laughs> Good. Because I'm an asshole. Because it's what they deserve. I'm like, look, guys, I'm pumping out funnies here. And I understand that, like, percentage wise, like, you're not going to land 100% of the jokes you make, but I got a good fucking batting average because I make a lot of jokes. Right. It's like, like, how do we let people know? Like, I'm funny, and you're not understanding why I'm funny. Right. And so I'm going to break it down and explain it to you. And you're going to be like, well, the joke's not funny anymore. And I'm like, yeah, it stopped being funny when you didn't find it funny. Yeah. You know what's funny? Your attitude. Please clap. The baby at this party yesterday. A Republican baby? Yes. <laughs> Actually, yes. Of course. Oh, yeah. I had to get into a whole conversation about government spending, apparently. With the baby? No, but the baby was Teach there. Him early. The baby was part of it. The baby was involved. Listen, the baby's first words were trickle-down economics, and so we Reagan to... was right. You know, a little bit of... We got our Reagan rockers, right? It's the, it's the baby squad of... This country's um, been downhill. Hey, we're getting then. in early on Gen... I don't gen. know, whatever Gen they're, they are or something. Okay, what do we got? 28%. Let's fucking Ooh. Go. Mm. I can fucking Pokemon Go now. Pokemon Get Gone. I'm trying. <laughs> I don't even remember what the fucking bit I was doing. More like before. Pokemon Gone. Pokemon Gone, girl. Ooh, I also want a sound bite that's just the Taken King. Like, <laughs> we should We should write these down. Yeah. This season. Available now. It looks like the good and juicy. Oh. I'm not going to spoil nothing because I'm not that kind of girl. Uh -huh. But uh, Large Lamp, I think you're at least going to be like, oh. Mm. Is it like opening mission stuff or is it like watch the Vidoc or whatever? Even if you just watch like the teaser trailer of it, you'll get the thing that makes – that will make you go, oh. Oh, there's a teaser trailer. Yeah, like the launch trailer or whatever. If you just watch that, you'll you'll feel something. Mm -hmm. You'll feel more than I felt about it. And I was like, oh. And I think you feel more about it than I do. But I was like, that was Does it involve a young man? No. Okay, so it's not that thing. Interesting. Is it the Final Shape Reveal trailer? I just searched Destiny 2, so it's probably my bad. Yeah, I don't use swipe. I don't know about all that. Oh, that's that, that's terrible and tragic and hateful. Is swipe good? Is swipe good? I've never like I've all, I used good? it once in like 2014. I love it. Okay. But that's just me. That's the only answer. If you want to okay. watch, if yeah, yeah, I have two minutes. Don't. I'm not I'll, doing anything. I'll do a raid while you do that. Yeah. The Are we gonna get claimed if we have? <laughs> all right. Do you want to like just like chill and vamp or pause or whatever, and I'll be back in two minutes? Sure. Okay. You can do whatever you want. We could just watch it together on screen. We never do that. We never do that. We don't have a Jamie. We could. We don't, are we Jamie? I could be a Jamie. Are we John Jamie? <laughs> John let me Jamie. let me pause it though while we figure it out, so we're not sitting here going. Uh. <laughs> Hell yeah. Be right back. I'm on hiatus, by the way. There we go. <laughs> I, we had this whole conversation. I forgot we weren't recording, but okay. I took a break from stream and I'll be back eventually. But that means that we have more time for this shit. Are you ready? Season of the Witch. Are you ready? I no, I'm not, sir. Too bad. Here we go. <laughs> Guardian, the witness poses a dire threat, and the Witch Queen holds the answers we seek. But only if we contend with her sister, Zivu Araf. It rests with me. Will you come back from this? Do not be afraid. Fire. 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 
and have entwined it with your light. Assault the Spire Guardian and open the way to our tithes. Let them know fear. The deck of whispers, and they do whisper. Fight in my name, Guardian. Every opponent you defeat strengthens me. My appetite rises for your brutal tributes. Let us show her what it is to be hive. You have flouted the horn of battle! You are deserving of the greatest death I can bestow! Okay. Ooh, there's a lot to unpack there. There is... Okay, so... That was probably very loud, by the way. No, it was. it was perfect. Okay, good. It good, was. Good, it good. was actually hitting right at about twenty. Because that was the as soon as it hit start, I was watching mm -hmm. that because like, I know the traps. Yeah. Can't get me, man. I never been got. Never. Uh, that is the coolest fucking shit. Right. Uh, I at first I thought, wait, is Eris hosting Zivu Araf? And I think no, it's actually that we are like, you know what. Fuck your sword logic. It's our sword logic now. Mm -hmm. We we just said, wait, no no one ever told us we couldn't do it. And to have Eris do it, mm -hmm. my fucking queen, my favorite character in Destiny, Eris Morn, because I want her to ride me and put her fingertips on the surface of my mind. Fingertips on the surface of my mind. God, like the runny mascara look is really what it is for me. I Three mean, eyes. But to yeah. make her more hive. And it's like, are you going to be able to come back? Mm -hmm. Like I'm gonna say right now, season of the witch is like they fumbled the fucking bag with Lightfall. They I know, fucking did, and it's like, and it's disappointing because I I don't want to be mad, I don't want to be upset, I don't want to say that I'm disappointed, but I am, and there's not a whole lot I can do about it. But to have, you remember when to go back a little bit, way back in the day before Destiny Two came out. Okay. We used to Godless talk. times. Mm -hmm. Pre-podcast times. Pre-podcast podcast times. Yeah, pre-podcast yeah. podcast times. It was like, they got to do something crazy. Like, they'll never kill Cade. Right. And if they Manhattan. actually follow, follow through, and they did, and they've stuck to it. Mm -hmm. and Or, like, I guess... Well, he is back now. In final shape. But they waited long enough, and there's enough of a reason that I'm like, you got me. Oh, I'm yeah, good. yeah, yeah. Like, I'm no, good. he's allowed to come back. Yeah, for, like, the finale. Yeah, because I, I I trust them to bring him back. Like, it's, it's yes, like, I don't I trust them. Like, it's, as much as I hate Bungie, I do trust them. Well, this is the culmination of the saga of which he has always been inextricably a part. So I'm like, yeah, it makes sense for him to come back in the close. And, you know, that kind of like, you know, did we lose hope because we couldn't do things the way we wanted? Or... Do we say fuck that and just do whatever we can? Mm -hmm. And like part, I think that like in a lot of ways, it's this. They're doing a really the one thing that Bungie's never been bad on is their themes, like the like liter like uh, storytelling themes and like mm -hmm. the beats. Like a lot of times in the, well, not every story is written well, but like yeah. the overarching concepts of like the light and dark, right? Mm -hmm. Is pretty fucking crazy, and it's like I remember like all the shit we've been dealing with, where they're like Drifter's too dark, and Eris is getting sussy Baka, and you know, but it's okay. It's if all I can just fucking brood, I guess, you know, and then the brood queen, the brood queen, and then Akora's there. Yeah, I love Akora. Bald. She's well, she's doing shit. Mm -hmm. Absolutely, serve Diva. Work, work. <laughs> <laughs> I just to make her a hive like. She, she have become, her own hive witch. She's a hive god. Or hive god. She's the hive god of vengeance. 
and she's writing her own book of sorrow and we're tithing to make her stronger to make her the strongest tithe god and I'm fucking excited. I'm kind of turned, like, I'm not going to lie. I've got goosebumps and I, mm-hmm. I'm i kind of like just turned Half on. Hard. Yeah. <laughs> Is that weird? Or I, like, obviously it's weird, but like, I didn't like, I'm, I, I'm not feeling it, but like I'm in, internally, uh-huh. I'm like, oh, oh man. When I first watched, I was like, that's fucking sick. Like, I was like, that's so fucking cool. The armor looks cool. It looks cool. We got cool armor for once. And they're all, they all look cool from the millisecond I saw them. I love hive shit. I love hive shit. And people are like, Bones. too much hive. I'm like, I didn't ask you. The hive are the hive coolest, are the coolest enemy. So let them be the most common enemy. Yeah, absolutely. Like, I, Or at least rather the most common theme of a season or whatever the fuck. I don't care. Mm. They're the coolest. They're like, the coolest. At this point, like the fallen, all of the other fallen seasons after the SIVA season have been boring. <sighs> Like, or at least like it's like oh it's it's fallen but they had the stasis and they had abominations and we kind of get a little bit of the the forsaken. I liked season of the splicer because like they finally committed to like the oh yeah some elixni are like. The, it, get, it takes time. Finally giving nuance to them, so I was like, I think season of the splicer was very successful. Also, mm-hmm. it was just fun. Yeah, all the data hacks. It was and just stuff. a good loop. It was yeah. a good. It was a good play loop. The color. I mean, just the color palette. I know. Um. But yeah, so like that was like fallen done like well, but like I was so sick of like I don't know. I mean like my least favorite is Cabal, hands down, easily. Like I don't I never cared. I never cared. I'm so tired of Cabal. I never liked them in Destiny One. I never fucking cared about them in Destiny Two. Green Bay. I'm not Gosh, gosh. Destiny Annie 3. is my stepmom, and mm-hmm. I don't care about the Cabal. Brockus Rex is my stepmom. Brockus Brockus Horrux, and yeah. I don't care about him. Oh, that's right. Also, I think I said that was a divinity reference. Yes. That's I was I was wrong, but I am not totally wrong. I'll take you, I mean, they both are named Brachus because I'm surprised. Yeah. Convenient. But who'd have known? Who'd have thought? Ooh, register. But yeah, it looks cool. Hive are the coolest. Absolutely. And she becomes a hive god. That's fucking sick. Absolutely. You you want to know what part of the cabal are cool? Hmm. Scions. Yeah. And we don't get shit for scions. No. We get big <clears throat> scion. <laughs> Like, uh, I love that it's just sort of canon that every race other than humans, if they're strong, they just get bigger. Because guardians aren't that much bigger than regular humans. Right. They're like pretty much human sized. Like no matter what, no matter what acts we do, we are, we are in, in most ways bound to a human body. So mm-hmm. like we stay the same size, but I love that through sheer happenstance, every other enemy race, if they're stronger, they can somehow just get bigger they could just make it work they're like if a fallen has access to enough ether they just get bigger oh which i'm not saying it doesn't make sense for some of the races to do that because we even have that kind of a thing on earth like right now like Mm -hmm. there are types of you know animals and stuff where it's like if they have access to the resources if they live long enough they will grow to double the size yeah. of a standard member of their of their species which yeah, is cool they adapt to their environment like it's like one of those where why does earth have life at least at, you know right now in a scientific way it's like mm. we just kind of are in a good zone yeah we're like we're in a zone where we're what was able to grow from that so yeah. so like I, I, it's not that I have a problem with the idea that at least some of the races do that because like there's precedent for that and it's cool and it works mechanically. So it's like it works canonically and mechanically for the game. So it's like, it's cool. Like big enemy. That's cool. Big boy. Juicy. We like that. But juicy, I'm like fat, wet, but I'm like, but every single race in destiny, except us, if, if, if strong villain, big, I watched this video once. Mm-hmm. I'm just trying to get in the mega ring. Yeah, yeah, I guess you could see me. I so. watched a video once that was uh, it's by Nathaniel Bandy, I think is his channel name, which is just his name, I'm assuming. Okay. But he did a thing where he was like, I rank every single Bowser fight from su- every Super Mario ever. Oh. And that's cool. His like, his, the joke the whole time is he's like, and then you won't believe it. Bowser gets big. <laughs> because, like, that's all he does. In so many of the fights, like, phase two is Bowser suddenly gets big. <laughs> Bowser's big. Bowser gets big. And that's how I feel like Destiny bosses are. It's like, it's a boss scion. How do we make it a boss? It's the big one. It got big. <laughs> 
not the Scion Flayers. They stayed small, and making them bosses was that there were just three of them, and they were quick. And that was an interesting new take. Back in Destiny 1. Back in Destiny 1. And then Destiny 2, they were like, oh, no, we're going to have that one, like, Scion be, like, the the strike boss on Nessus. Don't worry. Uh, He's Card- just oh, bigger. Oh, the DLC one. Yes. Or sorry, that was on the special pre. Oh my God, there's Carnivine. Oh, I've I've caught extra so that you have one. Okay, because I've never I've never even fucking seen one in this mm-hmm. stupid game. Well, I just popped a, a lure as oh, well. Okay, work. Um, or an incense. Also, I got Pachirisu, which I realized I apparently never have. I, I never had one either, I and I still like don't. I could have swore that I've had a million of them. So I thought like, so too, but then I apparently have it. Um. But anyway, yeah, uh, it's, uh, uh, yeah, it gets big, big. Yeah, so it's, then it's just always a theme. In Destiny like, Two, they were like, no, 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 no. Now when the Scion is a boss, he's big. He's big. It's just big. He's big. Big stomp. Big. Like I get it in terms of like the, the amount of content they want to get, the whatever, blah blah blah. Like, and you can like you is can make the wild? mechanics. Is that a You can make the mechanics different to like. I think that like you could change the mechanics of the fight to be a bit more interesting, but it is a bit boring when like. They're not even like stylistically, like they. I understand that they technically are stylistically different. A lot of these other bosses, like I'm thinking, um, the arms dealer strike. Yes. But because it's like you're just fighting rogue commanders or whatever, but like, it just is big. Like you could show me of all the cabal bosses, and I could barely tell. I could probably tell you what strike they're from. I could not tell I, you who they are. I probably could. I might be able to. It Maybe. would depend. I don't know if I could get the strike name correct, certainly, but I could tell. I could describe the strike. Inverted spire. Um. <laughs> yeah, like I don't know the names. I don't remember all the names of the strikes because, like, you you just go in the playlist. Yeah. Sabathian oh. song. Have you been getting a new unknown? I have. I have a. I have a handful of unknown. I got a Z and an M now. Mm-hmm. <laughs> but yeah, so mm-hmm. I'm just like, oh, it gets big. Okay, work. Work. I don't remember where I was going with that, but yeah, the the it just gets big. I'm like, okay tired it's not even wired but That's the furthest thing from it. anyway this season like i'm not saying nothing because like i haven't actually like signed back in so like the play loop could be fucking mm-hmm. boring still but i was like that looks fucking sick and that i'm excited for and i haven't been excited for destiny in a long time so good or bad i think i'm, I'm pumped to mm. at least try it i mean like and i would try it today but like i got, I got shit to do what do you got going on today Audios. Yeah. Yeah. But now having talked about it, I'm like, oh, but Destiny. But that's just for the reason to get the audio done so that then I can have Destiny. It, I guess if it helps, uh, if you want, like, I'll play with you. You know, the whole, like, ooh, after the starting mission, let's mm-hmm. meet up and, and, uh, and, and link up. But that way... You could get if that helps. You have a little bit of like a ooh, I do get to play it today because like I'm good with playing it today, or I'll play it. I'm doing a training raid again with Kenny, mm-hmm. um, and uh, like uh, Steph and Denny and I and everybody because uh, like we're gonna try to teach them. I think Val, like a uh, Val the disciple again, because mm-hmm. um, it took us a long time to go through it the last time, and like I don't raid often enough to actually like. I'm like I have a good idea of what to do, or you know. Let me do a couple, like, we'll do a couple tries and I'll be back. Mm-hmm. But, like, Kenny gave us homework of, like, make sure you have this type of stuff, whatever. And I'm like, I'm pretty sure I have it. Mm-hmm. But now that I'm glad that you got me motivated, because mm-hmm. I probably would have, would have uh, on Saturday morning, been like, okay, uh, let me go see if I have, let me log into Destiny for the first time now. Yeah. And so now I feel a bit more, uh, more decided. like season of the snitch. You right. It'll fucking work. Ah, man, I just. I don't know. Like the last season of Destiny was very okay. Quick question: Do you play FIFA twenty three? Thank you, Pokey Raid. No. Um. Yeah. Ooh, we are looking for beta trainers for a new app, Smart IV, a real for team. For FIFA? Oh. And then a different thing. Yeah. Mm. I'm trying to do mm. a Mega Rayquaza raid because someone was inviting me, but it was like too late. And then the other person's like, "Sorry, guys, there was a glitch." Mm. <laughs> there we go. Gonzo, but yeah, it looks it looks cool, and I'm excited to try it eventually. <gasps> Pachirisu, Ooh. I need you. You're coming with me. Mm. You're not escaping me. I just want to like I, I like I just would love if I could catch myself a, a shiny Rayquaza. Like that's all I would want from all of this. Like yeah, ooh baby, 
Ooh, baby, baby. Lots of Lapras. <gasps> oh, nice. Lapras. Nice. I should use the Master Ball. It's purple. Yeah. <laughs> I won't. But... No. You saved that for a Rattata. <laughs> so you want to know something? I love it. Shiny Rattata is green. Right. And I have told myself that if I find a shiny Rattata, I'm yeah. using a Master Ball and I'm giving it to you. Like, <laughs> like as a fucking insult. Like, just to... I would love that, though. Because you're like, I can't get rid of the shiny. It's like, and what's his name? Is going to be the other 99%? Because it's the wrong color. That's fair. Ooh, I don't think I have one of these. Ooh, I like Lapras. Like, have you... Look at, it, look at that animation. Mm -hmm. The little... Mm. Shaking his little tippies. You know... I'm going to watch what I say. I wish you would. I am. <laughs> I told you. I'm back now. I'm back you, from my trip. Some say you never left. People have been like, Odie, what the fuck are you talking about? And I'm like, you wouldn't understand. I, I'm, I'm, the, I'm, I'm the joker, baby. I'm like, you wouldn't understand. You wouldn't understand. You don't think crazy. Or not crazy, but just, what do you mean you're not on the same page I am? Am I moving to? I, 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 you didn't ask for a book. No, Pam, I've been doing that bit lately. What? I'm like, you know, these two guys, there's these two guys who've been doing <laughs> some crazy shit lately. Mm -hmm. Like quite a few years ago, these two guys put their brains together and came up with, a, they were cooking some crazy shit. They came up with an idea of to write a book, like the most meta book there is, mm -hmm. a book about books. Yeah. And you know what that book's called? I love that. The Bible. Mm. I didn't plan on making that joke, but then mm. I saw the line and I took it. Because <laughs> they're all little books. No, but the, the, the dictionary. And I love the dictionary. I love lamp. Did you read the dictionary as a kid? No. Yeah, me neither. Yeah. I tried to. And I got through the C's. And then I was tired. And my teacher said, we have to like move on to the next subject now. And I'm like, okay, what's that? And he goes, hey, guys, I'm going to show these this book of sketch drawings of people who say that they've seen aliens and so these are the aliens that they've seen and i'm just like and he was real for that yeah i mean we are the the public school system in in, 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 in california at the time the san joaquin valley school district was not uh f as funded as they, they wish they could have been but well well oh wait Ooh, oh i got nine seconds to get in the ray that they invited me get to in. wow Oh, work. Oh, work with a, like... Oh, hell yeah. Just bit bopped. Mega. 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 I, got, I still use one thing. Mm -hmm. Which is... Uh, yeah, you oh, God, I got another Pachirisu. The game is now punishing me. It's like, oh, you never had him? Here mm. you go. You're never going to get him. You're never going to get rid of him. I still don't have a fucking Carnivine, but it's like, don't worry. Don't worry, baby. Mm. Pachirisu all the way. Oh, and then he fled. Oh, how Okay, fun. so I don't get to have love in my life. That's cool. Mm. Have you noticed, have people been able to do it with five people? Do it? The Mega Rayquaza? Yeah. Have they been able to, to link up? Keep it up with five people. Um, yeah, if they're high enough. Six is ideal. I mean, 20 is ideal, but mm. six, well, yeah, me too. six is a solid. Yeah, I guess I'm, uh, like, I'm like... I've made it with five before. I'm like, I think I yeah, know you're fine. It. Like, I just got to be patient. Yeah. Which, I don't like raids where I have to... Why well, can't fast... Fast gameplay. Nothing feels worse than being like, I'm going to use my big guy who's got like max CP that I can do at this point because I just don't have enough big candies. And like, I'm going to mega involve this fucking thing. Let's go. And then it's like throwing a wet paper towel at somebody yeah. because the other thing you're fighting is too big. The yeah. numbers don't make any sense. And they don't have to. Mm -mm. Winning's for winners. I hate that one. Sometimes. They're so strong. Good things happen to perfect people. Yeah. They do. Yeah. <laughs> and it's wonderful. I love that. And it's great. And it's great. Mm -hmm. I love Pikachu. Pikachu is my favorite Pokemon. We love Pikachu in this house. Famously. I do want to talk about Pikachu. Famously. Actually. I agree. I think it, it, it's literally because like if your mom, if you were to ask your mom, what's your favorite Pokemon? She goes, I don't know, Pikachu or whatever. Right. It's n easily identifiable. But, but like it's... <sighs> It's tri well, it's not that. See, I don't it's think fine. that Pikachu's bad. It is, in my opinion, vastly overrated. And like, I think there's a difference between saying like, "Who's your favorite Pokemon?" Ash's Pikachu. Okay. I think that that 
is actually much more of a like fair statement to make mm -hmm. of swords. Wait, is it gonna like adjust my team? It's not. Yeah, I just I just don't care about Pikachu. No, it, it's it's fine. There's so many other cool, interesting Pokemon that never get the spotlight because it's always about Pikachu. Well, and even if you want to be in the same fucking line, I like the Prevo and the Evo mm -hmm. better. Like, Raichu is one of my favorite Pokemon. Really? I That's love cool. Raichu. Annie is my stepmom. You're right. I'm, we're not doing this. <laughs> like this no, 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 no. I meant like. You're not like, making that? No. You, you know how you could, you know, you mm -hmm. know when you know. Yeah. Well, yeah. your DPS goes down over yeah. time because everyone's Pokemon are getting worse. Mm -hmm. And so it's like, if it starts out like, uh, then it's definitely not going to end well. Yeah. Part of me is like, bail. Just bail. But I'm like, don't. You already paid for the. I, yeah, the it's, pass, I'm already in. So. so I might as well just. I, I, I'm going to complete the, the do one raid challenge. Yeah. 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 This is a fun episode. It really, this does. This one feels like a different kind. Like it's about games. I didn't think we could. I didn't think we could get away with it. Like I'm like, can we just play Pokemon Go since it's the Go Fest the whole time? And you were like, there's no rules that say we can't. There's no. There's no secrets this year. There's no. 2023. What's it for? No secrets. That's not true. Well, that's also true. Realizing it. That's right. You know, I quote you on that a lot. <laughs> Especially when I'm like talking to people because I'm uh, I'm always like I'll call Sin and they'll be like, "Hey, like what?" I'm like, "I need you to message me something. I realized something." They're like, "Oh, okay." I'm like, "I'm just driving." They're like, "Yeah, what's up?" And I'm like, "Neon God Genesis Evan Evan Godeon." And they're like, "Oh, what about it?" I'm like, "I don't know, but there's something there. There's something there. Just 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 message it to me so I have it written down somewhere. Mm -hmm. Like I don't know when I'll do something with it, but there's but it's in there. There's good bones. Good bones." And then since it's like, okay, anything else? I'm like, no, bye. Hang up. I deserve. Oh, yeah. I'm here. A lot of things. Yeah. Um, but I deserve a shiny Veldum. Yes. Same. Yes. We both do. I want one. We've so been bad. good all week, and we both deserve a mm -hmm. shiny Veldum, and that's that. Absolutely. And Absolutely. I, I want one. I want one so bad. It's, it is hands down one of my favorite shinies. Yes. It is cool as fuck. I fucking love Metagross, and I would like him. Now, now I'm now. I, I do it. Ooh, I like I like that all of these exclusive Pokemon are here for the fest, mm -hmm. like the Heracross, which mm -hmm. I guess I already had, but catching Carnivine, which the first time I saw it, like I had my Pokemon Go open while I was driving like over here, mm -hmm. and I like I hear the like, and I go, huh? Mm -hmm. I click on it, and then like because I'm still driving and it's just like Carnivine. I went, oh shit, okay, well fuck, I don't have that. What the fuck? Yeah, and I was like. Mm. And then it missed, and I went, oh, whatever. And it fled, and I went, that better not be the only one I ever see. Because that's happened before. Right? Yeah. They don't understand. Bestie. You and Orphe... I, you know, I should have known. Join an Orphe Uwu. Did you not make it? No, we did not make oh, it. no. He was like, oh, I'm sorry. There was a glitch. Whatever. Go go eat my ass. Eat my ass or cupcake. Put, put one, put, put two. Okay, well, then don't. Don't, they're like we can't we can't rate this raid room anymore. I'm like I don't want to. Oh wait, ooh. you were inside this one. Ooh. Then ooh, let me leave. That one. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> ooh. Please rate your host. No, he doesn't want the rating I'd give him. How about that? You're right. How about that? How about we talk about that? Hmm. How are these ones like? How are they getting like eleven people in this room? What do you mean? Like sometimes, like the raid rooms will be like ten out of eleven. I don't understand why not everyone just makes it out of like eleven. Like they all should be out of eleven, but they're not. Most of them are out of six, and I'm like, but I want to be in a big fucking group because I want to know we're gonna pull it. Yeah, but I think it's because like only one person, like you can only invite five people. That's why it's six. But you can invite you can invite five people every like thirty seconds. So as long as you like do it early, like they'll send it in waves. Wait, really? Yeah. <gasps> so like that's what they do. They'll like text out where they're like sent the first wave and they're like sent the second wave. Oh, I didn't know that. Yeah. Oh, look at this little look at this look at the little guy. I know. He's a bouncing. He has a hidden power. Ooh. Which is different depending on different things. I'm the same. You're crazy. 
You know what is interesting is I noticed that specifically for the GoFest update this weekend, I got one earlier here. I was a car bank earlier. Mm -hmm. Um, Whatever update they did, like the Pokemon, I'm like, oh, y'all updated like the processor or something because Mm -hmm. like shit's like moving and grooving. Like you ever like, you're like, oh, look at all these Pokemon. Yeah, they're whatever. And then they're like, hey, here's a Breloom and it's weirdly 3D and textured (laughs) for no reason. (laughs) There are some Pokemon that just have some weird fucking like detailed like like where did they get this model from? Like why why don't you just do the like 3D 2D thing? Yeah. Or two I don't know, 2.5D. 2.5. 2.5D. Look at this Pikachu. She's a little princess. But she got the QWP. I'm just tired of Pikachu. I just It's tired and i love that they mix it up sometimes and they're like here's fucking cowboy hat snorlax i'm like thank you well cowboy hurts like that's a that's a riot right i'm like he's got a little hat and like at halloween times they're like okay fine we'll give the ghost type some spooky spookies it doesn't have to be pikachu in a costume we'll put a silly little hat on gangi mm-hmm. and you know a little gangi a, a little gangi a little gangi for the table i'm so sad because you can mega evolve uh, a Halloween a little, a, little, a little witch hat wearing Gengar you can mega evolve it but then the hat goes away Oh, I'm like I want a mega fucking Gengar with this tiny little. precarious little witch hat hanging on his enormous head I mean everyone loves a big witch hat like yeah. like a little like little witch lady with the over big size hat yeah but there's gotta be something about the big guy with the little with tiny the hat little tiny hat because, like, when a shiny Megas, it stays shiny. But when a costume mm. Pokemon Megas, it doesn't keep the costume. Oh. Sad. Yeah. Cringe. Cringe. I I'm hate not. to say it. I, 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 I don't. I love saying it, actually. I've got to be real honest. I, I've, been, I've been dishonest lately. I love saying it. I fucking love saying it. I think it's interesting. I think that some things are fun. Sometimes things are for me. Correct. This hair cross is and not for me. people won't tell you that, but I will. I'll tell you. Sometimes Aiden plays games, invited me. Good for Aiden. I don't know why they, they like the Rayquaza is like looking at me dead on, which feels a little weird. Like his, With his little three finger hands, and he's like, "Bitch, a little bit, mm-hmm. bitch." He's sitting here saying, "Bitch, bitch. <laughs> a biatch, bitch." I'm gonna have to buy more passes. Here pass. I hope I hope we win this one. Zero of two ready. Was I the only person to accept? Probo pass. Sometimes it just takes a second. Oh, wait. Everyone leave the room. I'm going to try again. First wave of invites out. Sad. People aren't joining. Sad flop. I'm going to write in. Oh, wait. Zero of two ready. Mm. Although it's not even, like, loading. Yeah, sometimes shit's just fucked. Someone else said, like, oh, sorry, it glitched. So, I don't know. I don't know what's going on with all that. But, like, I'm feeling the vibrates of all these Pokemon with Lapis. increased shiny rights that I could be getting right now. So my Lapras isn't shiny, so I'm going to grind it into candy. <laughs> Good. I mean, I, I will, but... I think I forgot to nickname mine. Lapras. Lapras. Mm. Resisting the urge to back out. I guess I should back out. Yeah, just run away. Like, I, it hasn't started yet, so I'm good. Yeah. Oh my god, Lapras is an ice type. I need ice types. That's like the two things that I haven't finished yet for the stupid shiny Mew Mm -hmm. are ice and ghost because I haven't been playing at night and ice types don't happen around here and I haven't been walking much so I haven't been doing like the travel incense where you'll get rando types. Mm -hmm. Ooh! Ooh wee. What a a, a hoot and uh, if, if possible a half. Well, I'll think about it. Maybe a quarter mm. I could get you there. Or even a third. Maybe. You never know. know. Life is crazy. I don't know about a half. Oh, wait. oh, oh now there's GoFest 2023 Sky High, which is its own thing. Mm-hmm. Oh. It gets you another meteorite. Another one. Yeah, another meteorite. So, like, I have two meteorites. How do, like, what do the meteorites do? That you have to have a meteorite in order to teach a Rayquaza Dragon Ascent, and it has to know Dragon Ascent in order to Mega Evolve. Oh. So by getting two, you can evolve. You can mega evolve two different requests. Oh, interesting. Requests of your choice. I'm like catching these Pachirisu just as like see people in person, hear something. I know. 
I'm catching these unknowns and I don't give a fuck about them, but mm -mm. they're well, here. We'll see. And you got to catch whatever it is to open up the new, to get the next thing. Yeah. Like, cause you only get the one cause we're not at a hot spot. Yeah. With the, with the lures. So it's like, I got to catch the bitch in order to keep on keeping on. Yeah. What's the other things? Two research tasks. I was fuck, like, I hate that. I know. Cause like, I really like, I know that I never have to worry about. I'm them. right there with you. You understood. I uh, it is understood. I'm not spinning ten poke stops from here. I'm I've done two routes now, and they were the same ones. And I didn't realize that like a Zygarde cell isn't something that just happens at the end. It's something you have to be like actively looking for, and it comes up like on your screen. It's like a little thing, and you have to click it. That's I didn't so know cool. all that. Yeah, but I didn't know all that. Oh yeah, so you've so, been wasting them. So well, I don't. I haven't seen any, but I also haven't been looking super closely. So like, I probably missed one. And yeah, I didn't know. I've I've never done a route because you're not. I, as far as I understand, you're not guaranteed them on every route. Like it's like a, a mm -hmm. chance thing. Do you have chance to be part of the Wayfarer thing? Wayfarer. Like I don't understand how to make a route. So in order to make them, you have to be level forty-eight. Which I didn't know at first. Oh, that explains why I can't. It's because I'm only level 40. Yeah. Or, or level 39, whatever. But people have made the park near my house into two versions of it, which is really cool. Ooh, and they both 40. got approved. They did a half loop of the park and a full loop of the park. Oh, that's work. Which I was very grateful for because it was fucking hot. So I did the half loop twice. But. Yeah. Yeah. But I didn't. I didn't. I is have, it fun? Like, how long is that loop? Oh, that was quick. It's like eight minutes. Oh, that's nothing. I mean, it says 16 minutes, but like, just hoof it. Like, come on. Yeah. Or like, you know, you just do whatever you pace. Like, I, oh man, that explains it. Cause like, if I could make roots near my house, I'd be tearing it up. Someone will probably make that park into a route. Although it is a very small, small park. park. Like, but they the, still could. The morning, my morning walk that I do, like where I start, I do, like I do my little pathing and shit and I explore my neighborhood to mm -hmm. find different ways and all that. I'm like, I could be make, I could be tearing it up, but I'm only level right. 40. You'll be running numbers. I'm trying. I'm trying to run these numbers. Carnivine again, which me tired. Sand slash. Is there even a fucking shiny? Do it? you oh? Do you carry a lunchbox? I don't know if there's a shiny carnivine in the game. I was about yet. to say I don't. What's that from? Like I don't. Do you carry a lunchbox? It's actually. I think that. Oh, that's from that's so Raven of all things. Oh, work. But like. That clip I love so much because it's uh, uh the redhead. What's her name? Uh, Chel Chelsea? Chelsea. I think it's Chelsea, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. And they're like, they're all dressed up and they're pretending to be like fancy people or whatever. And like, I think Raven is supposed to be like, they're, they're pretending she's like some famous pop star or something. Oh. Mm -hmm. So like when people are like, we've never heard of whatever her like fake name is. And they're like, do you, you know, like, do you watch the news? Do you go <laughs> on the internet? And Chelsea goes, do you carry a lunchbox? <laughs> <laughs> And I just that's, that's funny that that's the one like line from that show that is just locked in my brain forever and it can stay there because I, I like mean, it god will fucking blast dude because do you carry a lunch box do you carry a lunch pail Ooh, that's, a, that's a garbage, a garbage pail garbage pail garbage pail throw all well your dreams in the garbage, garbage pail <laughs> grow the fuck up you will die except the existential crisis of life I didn't think about it too far ahead but mm 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 mm, -mm. Oh yeah, let's get fucking ripped <gasps> on Dragon Tales. <laughs> I thought of something today. I'm trying to remember what it was. I, I so like the uh, the the I you know me. God forbid I say anything out loud that feels good to say, and the echolalia starts going nuts, and I'm like, oh baby, ooh but, baby, a triple. The meme. I'm getting ice ooh, types. Good for you. I stay getting ice types. Anyway, I've been thinking. I'm just like thinking about memes and shit, and I'll just be like sitting in the car, just going. <sighs> That he they pussy hit different, you know. And I thought of something in the car on the way to your house, but I was too busy talking to Tyler that I didn't have time to like. I couldn't interrupt her to tell her my funny because yeah. she wouldn't get it. I have to explain it because it's me. I couldn't just tell you the funny and trust that you know. Yeah. Because like, I don't care what you think is funny about it. I want you to be. I want you to find the way I find it funny to be funny. Yeah. I, fuck your lived experiences. You should know mine. Fuck your chicken strips. Oh God bless. Fuck your chicken, chicken strips. strips. Wait, what was it like? Oh, I want chicken strips. Fuck your chicken strips. Mm -hmm. Ooh, little... Now I want chicken strips. Ooh, chicken strips sound good. So does pizza. So does any food other than what I should eat. You know? Yeah, I, I think... Know. How many Pringles have I eaten? You've had quite a few. 
That's all I've eaten today. Work. Mood. Yeah. Not. I had, a, I had a hot dog. Oh, how fun. It was good. Yeah? It was a hot dog. Was she nice? Well, I didn't ask. <laughs> <laughs> Funny. Ah! Ah! Ooh! Ooh! But yeah, I don't know. I mean, I'm just... I'm just, I'm like, not hungry in the morning. Probably because of my meds. But, probably. like, I just get up and get going. But, like... Another fucking car. But I'll eat. That's the thing. Well, like, you got teeth, don't he? <laughs> 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 you got teeth, don't he? Did I add this guy correctly? I, I do that thing where... I know. You do the same? Oh, yeah. Do you ever, like, you hop back in, you're like, I gotta add this person. And then you're like, oh, shit, I forgot. Because you were too busy clicking on something. And then of, like... You, you you thought oh yeah wait oh there's a like a balloon too I'll just do it real quick after you accepted it and the amount of time it took for you to do the balloon and then the you missed the raid invite <laughs> so you just leave the raid and pokey raid and just be like damn I didn't get it sorry guys oh it glitched it, yeah. it glitched, <laughs> it glitched. <laughs> oh I glitched it glitched wait, wait, I mean look who who would just <laughs> who would I who would go on pokey raid and just tell lies. A fucking shallows? Are you kidding me? Would I look like a fucking joke to you? Mm, sometimes. Yeah, I don't know, because I'm so funny. Raid full. People have sent stuff to the guys or whatever. Are you guys going to act like it? I just would like to do, like, a single raid. Do you remember Jersey Shore? Oddly enough. Uh, yes. Do you remember Sammy Sweetheart from Jersey Shore? I do. Who never went by Sweetheart, but in the intro was always referred to as Sammy Sweetheart. Mm -hmm. I do. I do recall that. There is a there is a gif on my phone that I have from her where she goes, funny how people become pussies all of a sudden. And so then and I've like never sent it because I've never really had cause. Mm -hmm. But I am uh, amused by I then saw like a. Uh, a, 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 an internet may may mm -hmm. that was like it was that it was like oh, oh that okay. was peculiar that was weird that was silly that was odd hmm yeah I think we it's probably a, a good time just in general that like we should probably do something about this room. What problems you got with this room? I don't have any problems with this room. You have every problem with this room. That's what you said. You said that. Those and were your words. I did. You said this room is shit. It ain't ever going to be shit. Well, yeah, that the is true. The way it walked down the runway was shit. The way it sold its book was shit. It's shit. That's you know, you everyone else wants to be here. Except for you. You understand? I do. <laughs> <laughs> when I go, hey, we're doing the podcast, I can just feel you going, can he just show up? Why does he have to ask? Because now I have to make a decision. I joke, but is, does that? Do you ever get that vibe sometimes from things? What? Where it's just like someone's like, "Hey, are we still doing this?" And it's like, "Why couldn't you like? Don't ask me now. I don't want to. You could have just shown up, and I would have been like, "Well, that's what we're doing." No, because I'm the one that's always asking. Really? Yeah. Mm. Like Brandon will make plans like three days in advance. He's like, "How about you come over at like X, Y, and Z time?" I'm like, "Okay, cool." And so then day of, because it was like three days ago, and I don't want to just show up out of the blue in case something changed because shit always changes because Brandon it's them. Too. Yeah. In particular. Yeah. Yeah. And so then I text and I'm like, hey, are we still on for me to like head over? And then I get like no fucking response. And then eventually I head over and then I get there. And then he's like, why did you text me that? Why didn't you just show up? I'm like, because there have been times when I was like, okay, yeah, we made these plans. And then I show up and then I'm like, Hey, I'm here. And he's like, Oh, sorry. I forgot. We're at like such and such. And yeah. I'm like, cool. This is why I asked. You could just respond. Ye. Exactly. You could also go, you like, can just do a thumb up react to my message. <gasps> spinner rack. I love spinner rack. I'm making a video about spinner rack soon. I've, been, I've had notes. My thing with that, I agree with you. And I understand your frustration there mm -hmm. is also like for what it's worth too. you know, if you can't do something for whatever reason, you can just say, hey, I'm sorry, but something came up. And the other person goes, okay, no worries. Because okay, yeah. is there a higher rush than canceling plans? None. 
Don't none. think it's better than that. Nothing over the counter. No. So, you know, like, I, that's something I've have to learn myself, too. I'll be like, oh, God, I don't, like, I don't know. I don't know. I want to see. What are, other, what are other people going to say? And it's like, sounds like you just don't want to go. It's you not about say that. people. Yeah, you're right. Sometimes you could, like. People keep inviting me to these mega red closet raids. And I'm like, guys, uh, I understand, like, my pussy's popping and you want it. But maybe you don't need it. I'm maybe just, I have enough mega candies. Yeah. There's just. I'm trying so hard just to get in a mega ray closet. This green isn't shiny, and I'm mad about it. And As I want him gone. I want him out of here. I want my little snot boy. Done and, quite frankly, dusted. You understand. And he needs to go. Oh, he fled. As he should. Good night. He said, oh, I'm not shiny. You don't want me? Fine. I'll leave. And I'll say, you saved me a Pokeball. Thank you. What, this little QR pad, right? Is it a QR pad? Is that the right phrase? No. QI. QI. Okay. That was close. Um, yes. I'm, yeah, surprised. Is it, do you put two phones on that, technically? No, you can put a phone and a watch on it. Ah, so that little indented section is the phone side. Mm-hmm. Interesting. So like, if I could put that this on here, or does it have to be a specific watch? I don't know. It might work. Give it a whirl. Yeah. I think any watch that can be charged wirelessly would, I don't believe okay. this one can. Okay. Dragon Tail, Dragon Tail. It's almost time for Dragon Tail. Get oh. fucked up with Dragon Tail. Turn the fuck up and get loud. Oh yeah, baby, let's fit. Let's fuck with this crowd. Pump the energy up real high. Oh baby, don't you lie. Let's grind. Mm. Unwind mm, 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 mm. Play that song again One more time Now let's do it again And make it wrong mm. Dragon Tales Dragon Tales Twerking it out Dragon Tales mm, 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 mm. Yeah I'm Trying to think Carbink Carbunk Carbunk <laughs> <laughs> That's a lot of car bunk, if you ask me. That's a lot of car bunk over there. What? What? You're gonna quit your job? Oh, oh, oh! Oh, what? You're gonna quit your job? You're gonna go run around in the forest and just catch animals and and be an animal catcher? Is that what you're gonna do, kid? How are you gonna pay bills with that, son? Car bink. You're gonna fight. You're gonna you're gonna dog fight with other people and then you're gonna rob them of money. That's what you're gonna do to to get big and famous, son. That's what you do. That's, That's what, what I did. Do. That's what you do. Car mm. bink. That's what you do. You. You. <laughs> a little just, <clears throat> just give him a little squeeze. Just give it a little juice. <gasps> Carb. Boom, bink. <laughs> that was good. <laughs> Go. Bink. Bink. Carb. Bink. Uh-huh. Go. Bink. Carb. Bunk. Bunk. Carb. Car bink? Nah, man. He got that car spunk. Damn, damn, damn. Glamly. Galarian. <laughs> Have you seen any of the, the new Pokemon stuff that's been coming out? Like uh, some of the new Pokemon. Geist. Yeah, Polchigeist. I actually haven't like watched the video for that. All there, like there was suddenly a week of news like yeah. where stuff came out. The only one I cared about was like the Pokemon Presents, and I did my little reaction mm-hmm. video to it. I did a little stream with it, fun time on my YouTube channel. That being said, da, then they release more stuff, da, da, da. and I don't like that. Now I got to make sure I, I take note of like what Nintendo does. Is that if I want to start reporting on this kind of stuff because I think it is fun, mm-hmm. I'm like do the react to the direct, and then remember that I got to keep an eye out throughout the week because they tend. I've noticed a trend now that they will put something out for their direct and then within a week or two they have some more shit out but i'm like well i didn't know nobody told me nobody told me nobody told me it's like well they didn't tell anybody i'm like i know right but they didn't tell me they didn't tell me like no one dm'd me saying hey have you seen this dmc which i kind of hate when i get like it's like hey here's the link have you seen this and it's like the link shows the pokemon because that's like what the video is and i'm like but i want to see the reveal but it's not their fault it's 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 the thumbnail's fault they give it away in the thumbnail. 
Just give it away. Baby. Ain't nothing in this house worth fighting over. Ooh. Just give it away. Can I stop getting Hisui and Growlithe? That's all there is right now. That's the only thing that they make in this goddamn game. All I want is to have everything I've ever wanted. And I don't think that's so much to ask. Mm -hmm. You know, I got, I got something. How's your 2023 been? Been for realizing things. Oh well, yeah, it's well, been pretty great. Like in terms well, of like actually, any of your no. goals, like where you were in January. Like, uh, where were you on January sixth? Um, Hooters with the rest of the fem boys, not doing anything illegal. Nothing crazy. I did nothing illegal on January sixth. I understand. Now, me, now I'm panicking. Going, can I go to my complex security cameras that I used to live at and go? Was I jaywalking? Because they'll get me on that. You were, uh, how about this? You were, you were, you have never been, uh, criminally indicted for any actions taken on January 6th. That is correct. I can say that. You can say that. <laughs> you know the meme I sent you? The Lindsay Lohan meme? Yes. I, could, like, could, how, how do I get that on a shirt? You print it. Just print it. Is it hard to do that? No. Okay, what, what do you do? You have to use materials, or do you just pay to get it printed. You get iron-on printable paper. Oh, and then you get a white T-shirt, and you stick it on, and you iron it on. Wait, really? Yep. That is so fucking cool. Yeah. How expensive is that paper? It's quite cheap. What, Eighty-five dollars a ream. Oh yeah. Oh, I'll ream you. Oh, I, I know you. I'll know you'll have some. Oh, uh, I know you'll have. Some. I ordered ream for the table. Ream for the table. Ream at home. Mm. We're one and the same. They understand. They, of course they do. They got nothing else to do. Except understand. Ream. They've watched. Ream. Us. Oh, I love my Ream camera. It's great. It's. I bought one. I bought a new one for the house. Oh, yeah. My Ream camera. Ooh. Is it big? I'll show you. Oh. <laughs> show me how big and thick and girthy your, your Ream. How big is your Ream? Ooh. How big is that ring, and how big is it about to get? Well, <laughs> <laughs> hated that, hated that, famously. And you ain't gonna love the rest. Well, uh, yeah, I, I'm, I'm cooking. Uh, yeah, yeah okay. <laughs> I got. <laughs> God damn it! These, what is with these chicken shit raids that are like three out of ten people? I'm like, oh, okay, and they're like, we got two minutes left on this raid. I'm like. No wonder there's nobody in here. No one wants to be in here. Anything with 20 minutes, you're not getting into. If I use my second meteorite on my other shiny Rayquaza and use that to make him learn Dragon Ascent, and then I trade him and with him having learned Dragon Ascent, will that person then be able to mega him because he has, because it, or is it going to like take the move away? Is it gonna say if you're trading him? No, you don't. We're we're just oh. like magically wiping the fact that he had learned Dragon Ascent. And no, now he knows Draco Meteor or something. Like Maybe that. or Aerial Ace. Well, I think if you traded it, like at the same time, like you could trade it to me, but if I don't have the Mega Energy to Mega Evolve him, it's not gonna matter. Right, but you could get the Mega of what? You could get the Mega Energy later. Mm, possible. Though unlikely. Flop. Oh, they were apparently waiting for last one, which was me, and I'm like, oh no. Waiting. Waiting, 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 waiting. waiting. About 15 minutes later. Manager Jen. Do we have anything else to say? Not really. Here on this Pokemon Go podcast. Like, do you, th you think that we should just kind of like call it instead of Maybe, like fucking instead of just minutes? talking about nothing? <laughs> well, we always talk about nothing. Should we respect I mean. their time? I mean, we could also respect our own. Oh, wait. Oh, I never thought about it like that. See ya, nerds. It's our time. It's Pokemon Go Day. It's Pokemon Go to the fucking it's fest. Go to the, go to the fucking <laughs> fest. <laughs> Hell yeah. Goodbye. Goodbye. <laughs> See you next time.